Hi everyone, we are doing a video series on essential oils and kind of the basics and some fun facts. So this video I'm going to share some of my favorite oils that I use and how I use them and then how you can get your own. So if you missed last week's video, be sure and check that one out. I will drop the link in the description. Um, the first one I'm going to talk about for this video is lavender and this one is an awesome oil because there are so many uses. Um, your body, like I said in the last video, your body knows exactly what it is and it can send it exactly where it needs to go. This was one of the first uh, single oils that I really liked because we had a very young baby and lavender is very calming. It's great for supporting your skin. This is definitely one of my top picks for every parent because of lavender and it's just very gentle oil. You don't have to worry about diluting it. You can if you want to, um, but I've always put it on my kids straight out of the bottle. Um, it can be used at bath time in bath salts to just help it disperse through the water a little bit better and help those little kiddos calm down before bed. You can put it in your diffuser at nighttime to help them calm down. Um, we diffuse this mixed with some other oils pretty much every night um, and it's great for your cardiovascular system, your nervous system, your emotions, and your skin. We have uh, three girls so we have lots of emotions. So lavender is a great one to try and it has many, many uses. Um, so if you're not sure what oil to use, lavender is probably a good place to start. Um, I use this in the diffuser most of the time or on like diffuser jewelry. Sometimes I will smell it straight out of the bottle. And then if I ever have any kind of skin issue, um, I will apply this to my skin or I'll add it to my face serum or my face wash. Um, it's just a very gentle and very good like all purpose kind of oil. So that's definitely one I would recommend everyone trying, especially if you have children. The next one I wanna talk about is peppermint oil. This one is another great oil, not to sound like a broken record, but this one also has many uses. It can be very cooling, which is nice for the summertime. Um, you mix it with some water and Epsom salts, again, to help it disperse a little bit better and shake it up and spray the back of your neck for an instant cooling sensation. Very nice on those hot summer playdate playground meetups. Um, we use this probably the most in the summer. My husband also likes to put this in his water um, and drink throughout the day just to help with his occasional head tensions that he has. Um, it helps to support the digestive system, nervous system, respiratory system, muscles, bones, and skin. It does come in the Vitality. Remember that's the white label, which means that it is safe to ingest. The only difference is the label. No need to have a large and a small. The only difference is the label. So it's really refreshing in the summertime if you're looking for a cool off kind of thing. Peppermint is a great place to start. And there are a lot of bugs that don't like peppermint. So it could even benefit to keep away some bugs that you might not want. Now there's a blend that I want to talk about. And this one is called Thieves. This is amazing. It's a blend of rosemary, eucalyptus radiata, cinnamon bark, lemon, and clove. And this one is great for your immune system. So we have this spread all throughout the house. Um, I'll save bottles when it gets pretty low. This one's getting pretty low. So when it gets to about here with oil, I'll fill up the rest with a carrier oil and pop on a roller top that you can also get from Young Living. Um, it's just a metal ball. So instead of the drop application, it's just a ball that you roll on. And this is great to roll on down your spine and the bottoms of your feet because that's where you have a lot of nerve endings. So it gets into your body really quickly. So Thieves is a great blend to use just to help support your immune system, your help you're just helping to beef up whatever your body has already got going on as far as keeping things in check and keeping the good stuff in and the bad stuff out. Um, really great if you are around people who have been uh, maybe coughing a lot or just kind of not feeling real great. It's always good to give your body the support that you can whenever you can. And of course, you're always you're already doing you should already be doing the other things like drinking lots of water, eating fresh fruits and vegetables, eating as close to the earth as you can, meaning if you're getting from a farmer versus the grocery store, that is really the best way to get your food. 
but not everybody's there. So just do the best you can with your diet to make sure you're moving some kind of exercise. And then you add in things like supplements and essential oils, and you're just setting your body up for the best that it can be. I mentioned um, diffusing and I mentioned rollerballs, um, just popping on top of the bottle that you save that I wanted to share something um, that I found in my research. It was way back in 1997. They did a study where they diffused thieves and it actually reduced a type of an airborne organism by 90% after 12 minutes of diffusing. And then it reduced it by 99.3% after 20 minutes. So thieves is one that would be good to put in the diffuser too. So roll on the back of your spine, roll on the bottoms of your, your, your feet and diffuse throughout your house. So that's a good option for diffusing. If you have never tried essential oils, I would really encourage you to give them a try. Um, some people think that it might be like all in your head, but if you have small children, you will quickly realize how much they gravitate towards oils because children usually don't have all of the walls and things that adults have up. Um, they just know what feels good and they know what their body needs and they gravitate towards them. So it's a beautiful thing to watch if you've ever uh, seen children and their desire to put on oils. I love that my girls reach for them and ask for them when they need it. Um, if you've never experienced them, I will drop a link down in the comments or the description and I would recommend starting off with the premium starter kit. It is the best deal for your money. You get a diffuser and a bunch of oils. I think it's 11. You get a little cleaner, a little um, hand sanitizer, and then roller, those roller balls that I was talking about, you get two of those. So I will put that link uh, somewhere, description, comments, somewhere like that. Um, and I'll also put a link for a webinar that I did where I go into a little bit more detail with oils. I hope this video gave you some value.